See this picture behind me? This picture behind me is probably the saddest thing that I have seen all week until I read the results of a recent study. A new study is estimating as much as 90% of seabirds have ingested plastic. That's right. Okay, so we are talking specifically when we say seabirds, we're talking about pelagic birds, P-E-L-A-G-I-C, a group of birds that includes the adorable birds, albatrosses, puffins, and storm petrels, these birds spend most of their life on the open ocean. Now, what is so shocking? Researchers in the proceedings on the National Academy of Sciences looked at 186 species of these seabirds. The researchers looked at studies done between 1962 and 2012, which found that about 29% of birds had ingested plastic. Now, using models, we have realized that as much as 90% of the seabirds looked at now in 2015 would have plastic in their guts. Now, I've got some good news for you folks. This picture behind me is actually not the saddest picture that I could find on the internet. I found a different picture. Here's what happened in it. Same situation, bird with its entire stomach full of plastic debris, but this was a baby bird. And you know what the saddest part of this story was? This baby bird was fed all of these pieces of plastic by its parents, thinking that it was nourishing their child. These seabirds often mistake these little bits of floating plastic for um, fish eggs, things like that, that they would then ingest. And it is absolutely devastating, right? Check this out. Here is a number for you. The concentration of plastic can be as high as 5,800,000 5, pieces per square kilometer. So square kilometer is about 0.386 square miles of ocean. Okay, absolutely disgusting. According to a study from earlier this year, between four to 12 million metric tons of plastic washed out in the ocean in 2010 alone. We are totally screwing up. And here's the grand finale. Ba -ba 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 -ba. By 2050, 99% of seabirds will have some plastic in their guts. Maybe we have a problem here, folks. Maybe it's something we should think about. Does that look healthy? Is that worth it? Is that worth it to us? So things are really not going well. Um, people have studied it in addition to the smaller pieces of plastic. They've seen cigarette lighters in their stomachs, bottle caps, model cars, kids toys. They've seen it all. This is absolutely devastating, right? So we have got a really big problem here. Now, pretty interesting. Some things are happening that are moving in the right direction. Some cities are banning uh, plastic bags, that helps. Another thing that's a big problem are uh, when you use the face wash with the micro beads, it's supposed to like, uh, I don't know, like do some kind of micro abrasion to make your face uh, feel better. Um, Canada's thinking about banning that um, because that could have a big effect. And listen, Bottom line is we're screwing up here. This is not okay. We're not trying hard enough. We've got to do better. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe.